Welcome everyone! Welcome to another Let's Play. This is Metal Canyon, and we'll be playing uh, Mr. Prepper by Rejected Games. You remember I did a preview on this, and I actually quite liked it. It was uh, an interesting sort of survival slash uh, beholder type of game. And uh, now the full game is out. You might notice the 0.95 pre-release here. That's fine. Apparently the game is finished. Um, I'm just going to be posting this on actual release day. Because, well, they don't want us to spoil the story before release. So I'll just wait until, uh, yeah, well, today when you're watching it to post it. So we're going to start a new game. Day one. All right. Let's, uh... Let's play! The Path of Mr. Prepper. Prepare yourself for the war. So the story is, apparently you're living in a country that used to be free, but now isn't anymore and has suddenly turned, well, completely fascist, I suppose, or, I don't know, authoritarian. Because there's surveillance, uh, people are not allowed to leave, I suppose, and our job is to escape. Do you want to play the tutorial? You know what? Let's Ever do it. The plague and the change of the government. This town has been unbearable. Lifeless. Filled only with boredom, propaganda, and control. Ooh. I've tried to escape, and I've failed this time. But I'll find a way. They call me Mr. Prepper. Mr. Prepper. Yeah, let's do the tutorial, because, uh, yeah, I've forgotten a bit about it. A little bit. And we are back at your place of residence, citizen. For an attempted escape, we have confiscated your vehicle. This is standard procedure. I don't know why, why he has that accent, but he does. Obviously, you are also prohibited from buying or registering a new one. The agency expresses hope that you will not attempt to leave Murikaville again. <laughs> <laughs> oh sure, now I plan to fall back in love with this beautiful town. This is a commendable attitude, citizen. From today onwards, you are also on probation. I will come for a brief inspection regularly to check for any subversive actions or items. This is standard procedure. I am sure you will comply and my visits will only be a formality. Bless the president. Bless. Ah. This is a tutorial. Let me show you around. Okay. Oops. I thought I needed to uh, tick the, the box. Move the camera. Okay. Yep. Right. It's not a good time for that. Move Mr. Prepper. Okay. Oh, it actually gives you safe quantity now and stuff. That's nice. Because you, you used to be able to just uh, destroy everything and then, you know, realize, oh, I shouldn't have done that. Double click to run. Okay. There's also an option on uh, to uh, always run on any object to see what it c you can do with it. Inspect. Grab. There we go. Morning jog. I could use a short nap. You're tired. After your escape attempt, you deserve a nap. Okay. Let's go and nap, then. Oh yeah, I remember that. You get an achievement for sleeping. Oh, what? That... They're carrying a tree there? <laughs> You're hungry, go eat something. Okay. I probably should just select, uh, always run, I suppose. Open. Food only. Okay, uh, so should I eat a, a can of soup? Energy drink delays the need for sleep. Just don't rely on it as your main source of nutrition. Dried guarana? What if you, uh, destroy it, I suppose? Okay, let's, uh, let's eat one of these. Nom! This is your preparedness. Okay. It's your most valuable stat. Keep your preparedness high. If it drops to zero, you will faint. Stay well fed and well rested to keep it high. Okay. Safe quantity one. It would help to flip it first. What? Oh, yeah. This is where you do the plans. The ultimate plan. Uh, turn. Whoop. Bless the president. Oh, check your new escape plan. Okay. Hmm. 
Goal number one, survive. Hmm. Goal number two, escape. Okay, that's a pretty complex plan. Build the first room in your bunker. I need to think of what to start with. Alright. See, this is what I what I like. Uh, okay. Build. Not really sure how he does all of these things without getting noticed or heard. <laughs> but I like it. I also like this animation of it uh, excavating. It's pretty cool. And of course, it takes time to do that. You need to craft a ladder for your bunker. First, uncover your trusty workbench. So, I don't understand why these safe quantity 0 to 1. Why are these safe quantity at all? <clears throat> Wait a second. I've got two fuel barrels. That's not safe. Okay, so... Inspect. Oh, I just left click. No. Uncover your trusty workbench. I'm trying to grab... There we go. Safe quantity zero. Your workbench is a bit rusty. Let's see what you need to refresh it. Um, okay. A workbench. A prepper's best friend. Craft, disassemble, and work magic. But it better stay hidden from the agency. Of course, the, the nice thing is that you can simply place something over it, a cover, and they'll never find it. <laughs> You will need some metal and some wood. Start with buying eight units of metal. Oh, well, do I already have... Oh, no, if you click far enough, he automatically runs. So it's time for some trading. Make an order, collect it in two hours. That's how it should work. Oops. So, Sergei. All right, so we want... Uh, is that metal? That's metal, right? So, eight units of metal and... Oh, just eight units of metal. Trade. Trade it! Oh. This is your mutual trust level with this neighbor. Okay. <clears throat> level two. Nancy's house and supermarket. Every time you level up your trust, you will get access to more and better offers. You may also unlock more traders this way, uh, via neighbor's recommendation. Okay. Go to the forest and find some food. Ah, yes, the forest. The dungeon of this game. <clears throat> With the wolves and everything. Hmm. Let's grab these logs and get out of here. Ah, the smell of adventure. Come on. Alright, let's uh, grab this as well. <clears throat> and the log. So nothing else here. Oh, there's more of the food, more of logs, more logs, I like that, into the woods. I believe you can't go too far into the woods because that means, oh, go back home, because that means that, uh, well, you get wolves, and that's bad. Uh, let's go right back, there's quite a lot of deer around there, jeez, they're everywhere. <clears throat> Excuse me. Enough of this nature. Tip. Oh, home sweet home. So that should be there soon. Three logs disassembled. Okay, so disassemble that. Does he disassemble all of them? No. He disassembles one at a time. Okay. And it takes 20 minutes, I think. No, it takes 30 minutes. It's just uh, wait. It's 20, I guess. It's getting dark. And there's our supplies that we've ordered. Yeah, the game looks pretty nice, actually. Basic means of payment in your beautiful country. An apocalyptic dollar. Wow, okay. Receive your medal. I, I did. And now we can make something with it, right? Upgrade your workbench. Uh, workbench level 1. Upgrade. Oh, look, everyone turns on their lights and stuff. It's nice. All right, so now we've got a ladder we can make. I'll have to go and sleep very soon now. Because my stamina is pretty much zero. Let's cover this. 
Uh, how do I cover it? Uh, no, are they sure? Yeah, I've got a ladder, but... Okay, just place and drop the ladder where you want it. There we go! And yes, time to go for a short nap. You need lamps for your bunker, you need glass to make them. Let's disassemble something in the workbench. Yeah, but I need I need to go and sleep first. <laughs> oh, I, d I don't remember a computer last time. Oh, he doesn't want to sleep. Okay, because we're in the tutorial. So, uh, let's disassemble something at the workbench. Ah, and it's actually uh, showing us the stuff that we, we can disassemble. So, the safe quantity is 4 to 12, but how do I know how many of these I have? Does it tell me if I inspect? Not really. Well, I've got lots of them there, but it doesn't really tell me how many I have. So, I suppose I should just leave, like, two here, one there, and one there, and then I'll know that I have four. Can I just left click? No. Can I shift click? Control click? No, no, control is speed up. <gasps> it's so dark. <laughs> okay, so th this is safe, right? Yeah. So disassemble this. <clears throat> there we go. Oh yeah, I can select to disassemble more. And learn a new recipe by disassembling items. Uh, wall lamp, soil patch. So let's make a wall lamp then. What does this say? In bad condition, your preparedness is decreasing. Get your stamina and health over 50% to get into good condition. Tired. You're very tired. Your preparedness decreases faster. You should have a nap or go to sleep. And nighttime. You can call it a day and go to sleep. Place wall lamp in the bunker. Um, right. You can also make soil patches. But I'll follow the tutorial for now. Mm. I have to drag it. That's pretty cool, though. I, I, I do like that. There we go. Lovely, and it's all connected. You need to go to sleep before 3 a.m. Oh, there's the time. I was, <laughs> I was looking where the time is. All right, we'll still have plenty of time, then. I mean, despite the fact that they were, we were really tired. Oh, it's not a good time for that. I have to follow the tutorial. <clears throat> That's one of the things I always worry about in tutorials when starting new games. That they might gimp you a little bit. Oh, there was a guy walking past. <laughs> okay, so... Is it is today the first? Or is it the second? No, I'm guessing it's the second then. Because it's... So we're, we're getting a visit today. Trading increases your preparedness. All right? Ah, yes. Inspection is imminent. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Let's uh, turn and... Oh, come back up. I'm very low on health. Let's cover that. Oh, dear. Yes, yes. I'm coming. No, no, no. Cover it. How can I cover that? Hydro grab suspicious items. Okay, I don't understand. Yeah. It didn't give me an option to actually cover it. I hope that's not a bug. That's gonna be persistent. Checking the contents of the room. Well, of course he's gonna see this now. The room seems tidy and functional. I hope there is nothing illegal in it. Yeah, and now he'll see a workbench. Hmm. Under the previous government, we needed a separate warrant for every inspection. This was detrimental to the protection of security and well-being. And they're still taking that tree away. This is certainly not standard equipment in a lawful citizen's household. Fortunately, they don't take it away, but... Oh. I remember I used to be able to uh, cover it. Safe quantity one. Why is that one yellow and that one is... Keeping one's home tidy and is a standard is beneficial for all the citizens of Murikaville in the country. Or in the country. I'm actually surprised this is allowed. 
Oh, wow. Suspicious level. Uh, this is the agent's report. Keep your house in unchanged state so the reports stay positive. Essential items lacking, none. Suspicious items, yeah, see, too many barrels and too many workbenches. Do I have to actually craft something to cover my stuff now? Because it was covered. Oh my, that was close. I have to be more careful. Ah, you place it in the... You don't cover it anymore. Okay. So it is part of the tutorial. Can I also grab one of these? It's not a good time for that. Okay. I wonder... I can't get there. Okay, so he doesn't automatically uncover it. That's a shame. Right, so let's place the workbench here then. Uh, oh yeah, that's one of the annoying things. The lights kind of act like uh, furniture as well, so you cannot place stuff underneath them, I think. I didn't even have time for breakfast. Cook and eat some food. Okay, I'm trying to, but you're preventing me. There we go. Let's cook. Jesse, we need to cook. We need to cook, Jesse. Hmm. Just add some raw ingredients together, apply some heat, and voila! Food! Cooking makes your food richer. Alright, uh, so what are we doing? Remember that you will get the most of your food if you cook it first. Try to start with a soup or a smoothie. Soups additionally require water, you can get it from the sink. Unfortunately, I have to get all these things myself. Uh, I mean, uh, from the fridge, he doesn't do it automatically so uh let's just grab everything i suppose yeah and then we can cook with it beet soup carrot soup or vegetable soup let's uh let's make a vegetable soup and then put everything back deposit all okay but only the food that's good okay that's nice so let's eat the vegetable soup nom what did you say? Check your journal. I should start with checking my ultimate plan. Okay. It's not a good time for that. Let's turn this. I think I will actually set it to always... Uh... Oh yeah, I do have it on always run. Never mind. Establish a food source. Grow some plants in my bunker. I need a food source. Time to kick off my underground plantation. <laughs> the agent would not be happy to see that. To make your basic underground farm, you will need... Five room soil can be crafted in the workbench. Five seed bags, you may find some in your home. Seeds can also be bought in trade. Okay, so let's turn this just to be safe. And I think I'll make another expansion here. Um, like make a, make a green room. I mean, growing room. Yeah, let's, let's do that. It's going to take a long time, but... Let's do that for now. Wow. It's uh, going to take quite a while. Although, if you think about it... Oh. Hello. It's raining. Hello, Mr. Prepper. I hope you'll find the good news in the mail today. Oh, thank you. What is that? A letter. Dear neighbor, do you like flowers, herbs, and plants in general? Are you having trouble making friends in the town? Are you tired of urban life and sad men in suits visiting your home? Do you enjoy nature? If any of this is true to you, and I'm sure it is, please come to the forest during the day. You might meet someone friendly, a local herbalist. Okay. Build. I also like the music in this game. And I do have to remember to uh, get one of these and place it somewhere inside because it is not safe. Okay, let's uh, grab one of these. Yeah, it's it's a little bit misleading when you uh, first encounter the uncovered workbench and then you cannot cover it back up. Uh, but yeah, the tutorial does teach you about it, I suppose, so that's okay. Can I place it? Yes, excellent. But then again, actually, now that I'm thinking about it, I think I'll need to change this. 
because I I'll want another set of stairs there unless I can actually place them. Uh, can I place it high up? No. Oh, you can place it in front as well. Oh, okay. So, I'll need more. No. It doesn't work. I need space there. No, no. What am I doing? Okay, slow down. Stop clicking so wildly. Craft. Okay, so I need another ladder, which is going to be another three metal. Mm, bunk. Now, an austere bed. Sleep is obviously not the priority here. Why would you want that if you've got your own bed? Okay, so we need metal. I think everything is... I think everything is safe now. Here in, uh, in our place. Let's go buy our metal. Um, glass. Metal. He doesn't have any metal. Oh no, that's selling. <laughs> he doesn't actually have any metal. Yeah, that's food. Metal. Oh, these, these are metal. Okay, so I need three. I don't have a lot of money, that's for sure. <clears throat> and in the meantime, let's go to the forest and find some more food, although we are getting pretty tired, unfortunately. Due to all of that building. So let's grab as much food as we can, because obviously this is going to prevent us from dying. <laughs> and, uh... Probably other things as well. Is there anything else here? Mm, yes, there is. That's it, and I think... Yeah, there we go, we can go deeper into the forest. Did he pick it up? I think he did. What is that? Oh, you can... You can show... Okay. Let's see. So now we have to be careful, because there might be uh, wolves and such. No, there's a uh, deer. Uh, okay, some more wood. can certainly use that. I do wish he would automatically uh, pick it up with a left click. Okay, nothing else here. Wait a second. Oh, no. There, over there. <laughs> beep, 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 beep. Into the woods. And then it goes back. There's more wood here. Excellent. And that's it. Well, let's go further into the woods then. Our preparedness is going down quite a bit, unfortunately, now. Okay, so what do we have? Nothing on the left. There's some more stuff here. I think I hear something to the right, but I don't know if it's wolves or... What is that? Oh! Oh! Hello! <laughs> Suspicious bush. Ah! Oh, fudge! I wasn't hiding, just picking some berries. Bob, are you okay? Oh, it's the old lady. Hello, Buttercup. I knew you would come. You seem like a strong and capable young lad. Uh, I've been a while since anybody... It's been a while since anybody called me young. And you are? Oh, my manners. My name is Jenny. I'm the one who sent you the letter. Sorry for the secrecy, but uh, one cannot be too cautious these days. You can usually meet me here around this time. I'm a herbalist. Your contact regarding all plant matters, you could say. People call me Prepper. Nice to meet you, ma'am. Oh, just Jenny, please. And let me get to the point. I could use your help. See, I have this cozy cabin in the woods, but I can't get there now. There's a really vicious wolf hanging around constantly. I've tried everything. It didn't fall for my package of poisonous herbs inside a delicious sausage. Could you get rid of it for me? Uh, a wolf and a cabin in the woods? Is a red hood and a basket required for this mission? <laughs> You'd look lovely in bright red, but I'm not the fashion police. Just help me so I won't have to explain big ears and teeth to anyone. In return, you can take anything you want from the materials left in the cabin. I need to do some resupply soon anyway. And once I have my cabin back, we could trade with each other. Do we have a deal? We do. I'll deal with the wolf. 
You hear that, Bob? We'll have our cabin back. Oh, that's Bob. Can I take that? Probably not. Huh. Apparently I can. Alright, let's go back home. Unfortunately, there's no uh, one-click thing to go back. Can I click on that and go home? Hopefully. Yes, I can. Excellent. We need to go to sleep. We are tired. I'm actually surprised at something. Oh, I'm too... It's too much. Okay. Um, the guy who comes over, the agent, never actually checks our person for any illegal items. Wow, our preparedness is going down a lot. There we go. So he's gonna be here in uh, two more days. Alright. Yeah, this game is pretty fun. You can craft faster while your stamina and health are over 50%. Okay, I didn't know that. I could really use a snack. Ouch, we're hurting. Um, can I make a vegetable soup? Uh, what, what else did I need? I don't know, I'm just gonna take it. Cook. Oh, I can't make any. Oh yeah, because I need more of this stuff. I need cabbage, but I don't have enough. Oh, that sucks. Okay, deposit all, and just eat some of these. Yeah, that's, that's not gonna be enough. Nom, 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 nom. There we go. Uh, right, let's collect the water as well. I think. I think the problem is we're just. Uh, yeah, too heavy. Let's uncover this. Get rid of the. Uh, get rid of the wood we have. Uh, disassemble all of this. And actually, no, just disassemble all of it. It's fine. It's only like 15 minutes to do it. And now I'm gonna get the water, receive the water. Yeah, because I think it's pretty important to hoard it. Uh, so now we need that. So now we can make a ladder. Because... Oh no, we haven't gotten the metal yet. <laughs> of course. Where is the... Oh, it's here. Okay. Oh, jeez. I didn't realize I'm actually storing this much stuff already. No wonder we're overloaded. Alright, so now we can craft a ladder. No, we have to disassemble these first. Well, I suppose selling straight up metal for that guy would be too, uh... Too suspicious, I guess. Even though he did it the first time around. Okay, so now we've got a ladder again. Can I place... Yes, I can. Right over the top of this. I mean... Yeah, okay. There we go. Excellent. Alright, uh, I'll need another light, of course. Down there. Uh, wall lamp. I can actually make it. Excellent. Uh, let's make three for now. Not really sure how you make a lamp just from glass alone, but hey, if it works, it works. Why did it pause? Oh, because I've already made them. So soil patches. I need at least five. Wow, that takes a long time. Okay. And now he actually makes stuff slower because I'm below... Uh, yeah. Actually, let's go take a nap. I hope that's going to continue from whatever percentage it was. And I wonder if you get unscheduled visits later on, so it's probably safer to cover this when you go and nap. Yeah, but look, napping actually gives you a ton of stamina for just, you know, it's like a power nap. Something I never really understood, because I cannot do power naps. They destroy me. Oh, Karen. Uh-oh. <laughs> Good day, neighbor. Hi. Every day I feel thankful for living in Murraycaville. Why would anyone want to leave? Um. Have a good day, neighbor. Until next time. Uh-oh. Yeah, sure. Wow, she walks in a weird way. I, uh, I send some foreboding. Okay, so let's uh, continue with the soil patches. I have a feeling... Oh, continue. Yeah, there we go. 
Yeah, and even though it starts from 0%, it's actually much faster, so it uh, continues from where it left off. So I've got five soil, pa soil patches. Let's go and place some uh, lights down and such. So, uh, let's place one here, for example. Let's place one here. Man, this is pretty nice. I like this. What's that? Room upgrade box. Oh, yeah. Okay. So let's place down the patches of soil. There we go. I wish I could... Uh, oh, if you hold shift, you do fine movement. No, that's... Uh, can I place it here as well? Yes, I can, actually. Interesting. Even though it'll probably be best to keep that for uh, ladders. Uh, in fact, I'll... Yeah, I'll probably do that. Wait a second. Because if I'll go down lower... Ah, uh, you know what? I'll probably need more space for this anyway, and then the, ga the game will tell me how and where. So now I need seeds, which I don't have. So where do I get seeds? Let's check our house. It said that you may find them in your house. Not here. Can I close it? Oh, there we go. Basic bait. No. I wanted to take off. Can I close it? What? No. Escape? Yeah. Calendar. Okay, that's the calendar. Canvas. Save quantity 0 to 3. What would that give me? Textiles. Okay. Oops. Light electric box. Ah, there's a limit to how much you can use. The electricity meter shows current power levels in your home and the bunker. What's that? Oh, money. Excellent. That's actually a lot. But I need seeds. Ah, there's the seeds. Cabbage seeds, carrot seeds. Excellent. Let's also get the uh, water. Oh, it's not ready. You cannot take it unless it's ready. Lots more seeds. I like it. And that's just the water. Small square green box. What about this? Crate. Oh. Okay, I actually want to take this crate. And, uh... Well, I could take it apart, I suppose, but I can also probably use it for storage. Uh, right, so now we've got seeds. Let's plan stuff. Uh, I don't know, let's do carrots. Oh, yeah, I can also quick plant. Quick plant? Quick plant? Oh, that's the light level? I think. Yeah, it is. Wow, these lights don't really give a lot. Plants need water and light to grow. You can take some water from a sink. Keep your farm room well lit. More light, faster growth. Okay, let's grab that one. And place it... Ah, look, it also shows you how much light they'll be receiving. That's cool. I'm gonna place these down here. To try to make it as, as good as possible. That one on the right isn't really getting that much. Maybe it needs to be a little higher. Let's see. No. Okay. So now I need to water these. We're farming! Underground! There we go. Lovely. Food source established. I'll check my plan again. Okay, uh, before I do that, might want to... A relatively simple lever. Maybe it'll be useful in fixing the ropeway. Oh yeah, they call it the ropeway, which is kind of weird. I should also get the water because it should be ready. I'm going to cover this so I don't forget. And then we'll get the water. There we go, lovely. Ooh, that's a lot of rain. I would also be probably should be covering the window when I do this, but oh well. Look at that tr uh, tractor. How can I escape? Car? Plane? Rocket? No, that's just crazy. Escape plan. Run, Prepper, run! One, two, three. <laughs> Inspiration. 
Well, I don't have any inspiration. I need to do some more planning. How can I escape? I need to find some inspiration. Find inspiration for your ultimate escape plan. Okay. Turn on this. Oh, turn on. That doesn't do anything. Okay. Inspect. Okay. That doesn't do anything either. So. Now we need to find inspiration. I don't suppose we'll find inspiration here. I think you find inspiration when you get mail. Um... I haven't opened the trash bin yet. There might be stuff in there, even though I hate going out in such a downpour. Nope, nothing in there. Get back inside. And we've checked these, right? So let's see what else can we uh, disassemble here. Four to seven large square box. It would be nice if uh, it would actually tell you how many you already have. Four to eleven. So these four down here should stay. And I can take the rest of them. Wait. Yeah, small box. They're probably plastic. Do I still have those? No. The blueberries I put back. Bowl. How many of these I can have? It doesn't say. Green plate. Four to nine. One, two, three, four. I can take that one. And the rest of them. And there's pots. Zero to two. Okay. So don't actually need any pots. I have a feeling you don't actually need to... Uh, Oh, bread box. Phone. One. Mm. Let's uh, uncover that and disassemble some stuff. Alright, let's just disassemble these. That takes a long while, holy moly. Okay. But we did get metal, I think. Okay, let's cover that. Get our mail. You're delivering mail at half past midnight? Ah, so many letters to deliver today. Okay, what did we get? Take all. Okay, yes, yes. I I'm going to sleep. And we'll see uh, what letters we found tomorrow. So, anyway. Thank you so much for watching. I uh, really hope you're enjoying this. I think it's going to be quite fun. This game is uh, quite interesting. So yeah, thanks for watching. Please uh, leave a like and uh, subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet. And I will see you next time in the next episode of Mr. Prepper. Have a good one. Bye-bye.